Here's a Blender tip with Nathan. If you've ever rigged a character in Blender, you might have accidentally messed up your weight painting on one side. You may also know that Blender does not actually have a proper mirror weights function. Yes, there is a mirror button under the weights panel in weight painting mode, but this only mirrors the weight of one single vertex weight to the other side. So in my experience, I haven't really used this. It wasn't really useful for me. One of the methods you can use to mirror weights is to manually duplicate your desired weight, delete the bad one, rename the duplicate to match the old weight name, then mirror that weight to the next side. This method does work, but it tends to be finicky, and you need to make sure you test it and hit mirror vertex weight and mirror vertex weight topology a couple of times before it even works. But I found there's another way to mirror weights that's far easier to do and much more consistent. Just select all of your mesh on one side of the model and delete it. Make sure you delete every vertex so that you have a straight line down the middle. Then go to your modifiers tab, add a mirror modifier, and drag it to the top of your modifiers list. Then apply it and you can see that all of your weights have been successfully transferred from one side to the other. So long as your mirror modifier is above your armature modifier, you can just leave it and be able to pose and animate your rig as is. However, it's important to note that you can only apply modifiers if your mesh doesn't have any shape keys on it. If there are any shape keys, you will not be able to apply your mirror modifier or any modifier for that matter. Furthermore, if you keep your rigged model mirrored, know that any and all drivers you do have on your rig aren't going to work properly. But if your mesh does have drivers on it and you need to mirror some weights, it's better to manually mirror them than to use the mirror modifier. I hope this was helpful for you and I wish you the best in all of your Blender endeavors. Later!